Hi, my name is Ted, and I'm going to be talking today about mushrooms. <laughs> All right, here's, here's the story. Uh, I was riding my bike. Uh, actually, in this particular video, I'm walking it up a hill because I didn't get enough speed to get up the hill, and I had to walk the rest of the way. But I'm still getting exercise, so I don't care. And I'm walking up this hill, and I see some a couple of people with bags over their shoulder, and they're doing something out in the woods, and so... I get curious and I can ask them, what are you up to? And I'm going to play then what I, uh, what, what transpired. But first of all, I do need to mention the video on this. I'm sorry, I was not planning on taping these people. So the video, the camera is on my chest and I'm not looking, well, I'm not facing towards them the entire time. But I'm talking to them, and I want you to listen to what they say because what they say is awesome, interesting stuff. I had no idea mushrooms could be foraged here in Minneapolis, St. Paul, Minnesota. How's it going? Good. What you guys up to? Uh, just looking for some mushrooms. Oh. Uh. Yeah. You find any good ones? Um, they're a little bit dry and small. I think we need more rain. Yeah. Do you mushroom hunt? No, not really. So what do you look for? Um, like dying trees, like elms and stuff. We look for, in terms of species. Yeah. Um, we look for like oyster mushrooms, uh, chicken of the woods, morels. So early in the season, but it's just edible like, or what? Not, oh yeah, not um, not recreational. We don't have any species <laughs> like that. They're here in the wild, at least. Uh, is what is that's on Arizona, isn't it? Um, it grows a lot of more like temperate areas. And yeah. Stuff, so yeah. Um, but yep, not here. Oh okay. People grow it here, though. But yeah, I believe it. <laughs> okay, what gets you guys into mushrooms? Um, I worked as an outdoor educator for a long time. Oh, okay, um, that'll do just, it. Yeah, exposure and then just having fun hunting them. Yeah. Yeah, it's that's really, cool. It gets you out in the woods. It's something to do. Yeah. I shot hunt too. You know, looking for antlers and oops, look for agates and stuff like that. So that's cool. Just lots of lots of different outside stuff. A lot of the protein in mushrooms we can't really, we don't really use in our bodies. But, yeah. You know, but I know a lot of edible wild plants. And stuff. That's what I'm wondering, all those wild I... Yeah, there's, spring is the best time to forage for those, for sure. Okay, I had Boy Scout training on that one. Oh, Not yeah. very good. Yeah. My Boy Scout <laughs> leaders weren't the best either. Yeah. It just kind of depends on who you get paired up with. Yeah. It was just a lot of parents, you know. Yeah. I mean, that'd be an awesome thing. I spend a lot of time in the woods, have my lot, you know, throughout different things. But I definitely recommend like getting an Audubon guide and you know starting to identify stuff because it's yeah. really fun. Yeah, uh, that sounds like fun. It is. It's the best. <laughs> All right, you guys have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy your ride. Yeah, and enjoy and good luck on your mushroom Thank hunting. You. Oh, I have a question. Oh, yeah? I have just a fun channel that I put stuff on once in a while. Would you mind if I just put all that on there? What? What you guys, we were just talking about. Yeah. Um, I have a page actually that has about 12,000 local people following it. It's called Mushroom Hunting and Foraging in Minnesota. Okay. Facebook, but I also, it's also got an attached Instagram. So I post a lot of the stuff I find on there and you could connect it, your post to mine. If okay, you know. Mushroom Hunting. Mushroom Hunting and Foraging in Minnesota. I will never remember the rest of it, but I'll remember Mushroom Hunting in Minnesota and I'll, yeah, I'll figure it out. Yeah, yeah, you have about 12,000 followers? Yeah, yep, I have two pages actually. Oh, okay. I used to make my living from doing guided forays and selling. I'm licensed to sell them to restaurants, but I don't sell what we are finding now. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm a teacher. Yeah, I hear you. It's Alex, by the way. All right, bye. 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 Oh, my goodness. What do we have here?
been there before. I've not been down here. I don't think this goes anywhere. It doesn't. Nope. But it's nice. Ah. <sighs> <sighs>